Malkut is a word that means something deep. It's almost mythical. It's almost, you know, magical. When herding cattle, we would go by the river. And there are places, there are parts of the river which do not actually flow. They just swirl, you know, around like so. And those are normally very deep, deep places. And if you do not know how to swim, and if you found yourself inside there, you can't survive. But even if you knew how to swim, it's very difficult to navigate yourself out of Kut. So Kut is a place that is full of things that are going on, things that you cannot understand. There are forces that are in there that you cannot understand. And so even in the writing world, we have ideas that are unique, ideas that are queer, ideas that are weird, ideas that are very controversial. And sometimes we don't want to write these things. Sometimes there is an idea in our heads, but you don't want to write it because you fear that people perhaps will judge you wrongly. Or it will, I don't know, you don't just want to write it. Or you have written a piece, poet, poetry or a short story or anything, but for some reason, you can't even put it on Facebook. For some reason, you can't even put it on Twitter. For some reason, you can't even put it on Tumblr or Instagram or whatever. It's just there. There's something wrong. There's something really sweet about, you know, that kind of work. And as a writer, I know that. I know that happens a lot. I have an idea, but I can't write about it. And so I thought maybe we could try and have peace with this articles with these ideas and put them you know in some sort of anthology and i know there are great writers from around africa people that write so beautifully and i wanted to bring these guys together and share all these controversial ideas all these great things that they are thinking about but i've not been able to write or they have written but i've not been able to publish so came with the idea of good i talked to a few writers and they said, yeah, makes sense. So we decided to do it. And so here you are going to get very unique stories. Stories that are from the heart. Stories that are controversial. Stories that are beautiful. Stories that will wow you. And I am so, so happy that we can do this. So the idea of Kut is something that will be three times a year. And each and every time we'll be having different authors coming from all over Africa, sharing their stories. I cannot really talk about publishing because publishing has a lot of things. I have to talk to the writers, I have to, you know, take care of a few things and so if these stories become so famous shall I say then I will get back to the writers and then we can agree with the writers that we want to really publish these books in hardcover and then we can do that could are all types of stories Poetry, prose, short stories, everything. Kut is a magical world. A world where everybody, every writer can come, you know. And so that is all about Kut. We'll see how it, you know, come about.